What are you doing? I am protesting against Israel. Why would you do that? They are an apartheid state. You mean like South Africa was an apartheid state? Yes. Israel has Arab political parties. Did the blacks have political parties in South Africa under apartheid? They were illegal. There are Arab members of the Knesset, the Israeli parliament. Were there black members of the parliament in South Africa during apartheid? No, they were not allowed. There are Arab judges in Israel. Were there black judges during apartheid in South Africa? No, they were not allowed. There is an Arab on the Israeli Supreme Court. Were there black justices on the South African Supreme Court during apartheid? No, they were not allowed. There are Arab officers in the Israeli army. Were there black officers during apartheid in South Africa? No, they were not allowed. There is an Arab general in the Israeli army. Well? Okay, but Israel is still blockading Gaza. They do not allow unnecessary supplies. Israel allows in thousands of tons of food into Gaza. The UN distributes aid. More than 20,000 tons of goods were allowed in a recent week. No one there goes hungry. They do not allow in building supplies. A brand new shopping mall just opened in Gaza City. The Israelis only stop weapons and war supplies from going into Gaza. The Israelis walled in Gaza. There is a wall between Egypt and Gaza too. Are you protesting against Egypt? No. I am only interested in protesting against Israel. There is a wall between the United States and Mexico. Are you protesting against the United States? No. I am protesting against Israel. Arabs in Gaza have fired thousands of missiles into Israel. They have killed civilians including children. Are you protesting that? No. I only protest against Israel. They are an apartheid state. I prove that Israel is not an apartheid state. But I heard someone call Israel an apartheid state on NPR. Is that why you are protesting? It is the progressive thing to do. I thought progressives believed in things like gay rights and women's rights. Yes, that is what progressives want. It was big news in the United States when Don't Ask Don't Tell was repealed. Israel has allowed gays in its military for more than a decade. Hamas, on the other hand, kills homosexuals in Gaza. So why are you protesting against Israel? It is the progressive thing to do. Israeli women have equal rights. Golda Meir was the prime minister way back in the 1970s. The Arabs practice honor killings and female genital mutilation is widespread in Egypt. So why are you protesting against Israel? It is the progressive thing to do. Israeli Arabs have freedom of religion. A Christian library in Gaza was burned to the ground by the Palestinian government. Why are you protesting against Israel? I have no programmed answer for that. Let me think. Well? Some rabbis in Israel said it was wrong to sell or rent land to Arabs. Yes, but other rabbis said they were wrong to say that. Did you know that selling land to a Jew carries the death penalty in the Palestinian territories? Why are you protesting against Israel? But progressive. Everyone in Israel is free to choose their own religion. In Gaza and other Islamic countries leaving Islam is a death penalty offense. But I'm, I'm apartheid. NPR. Israel has the rule of law and property rights for everyone. In Gaza and in other Islamic countries, non-Muslims have no such rights. You are trying to confuse me with facts. Did you really just say that 